Parents re-entering the workforce may soon get help from New York City. A new bill introduced today would provide free job training to parents looking to get back to work. CBS 2's Lise Finch has the story. Four years ago, Erica Cohen quit her job as an attorney to care for her daughter. Now this Brooklyn mom is trying to re-enter the workforce in a different field and says it's been extremely difficult. I don't know the technology that's there now. I just have a big gap in my resume. I don't know how to explain that to employers or put it in a cover letter. New York City Council Member Ben Kalos introduced a bill that would help Cohen and all city parents get free training to re-enter the workforce. It's called the Back to Work Bill and it's co-sponsored by Kalos, Lori Cumbo and Robert Cornegie. The legislation would expand the city's existing Workforce One job training centers to include resources specifically designed for parents. So what we're asking Workforce one to do is get them the skills training they need for free and help them find a position at a company that will welcome somebody who's been a parent. Enrico Santiago supports this bill wholeheartedly. This Manhattan father says Workforce One helps him get back to work as a telephone programmer after he got laid off. You, just, you live a good span go by, they don't want to hire you because now technology moved up. You're not certified. And the hunt goes on. So far, there's no word on how much this bill will cost the city. People we spoke to said whatever the amount, it'll be worth it. It'll be helpful for a lot of people, not as, not only women, but men as well, because you have single fathers out there as well that's trying to do their best. I think something like this would be crucial for parents to be able to just have an idea and give them the confidence to get back into the workforce. The back to work bill has already been referred to a committee and supporters hope it will be passed by the end of this year. At City Hall, Elise Finch, CBS 2 News. And the bill was introduced today to cap off Women's History Month. Apparently, research shows that when women take time off from their jobs for family-related reasons, it damages their careers more than their male counterparts. Its sponsors say this bill is a step toward gender equality.